Welcome to Answer the Home. The pipe length measurement has a lot of factors to consider, like the fitting allowance, threads, centers, diameters, etc. Depending on the size and shape of fittings, the measurements can vary. Today we are going to learn about the process of measuring a pipe. One might find some terminology to make the distance points more specific such as center to center, CC, face to center, FC, also known as the throw, and the thread engagement, T, distances. For better understanding, follow the upcoming steps. Step 1, finding out the face allowance. One need to calculate the face allowance of the fittings that are to be set in the pipe end. The thread engagement or T is always required to subtract from the face to center distance to find out the fitting allowance. So, fitting allowance FA is calculated by the following expression. FA equals FC minus TE. Step 2, end-to-end -end measurement of the pipe. We will subtract the face allowance of the fittings of both ends. When the FAs of both fittings are the same, we will simply double it by multiplying by 2 and then subtracting from the main length. If not, the FAs will be required to calculate separately. So, the expression would be EE equals CC minus FA1 plus FA2. By following those steps, you can find the right measurement of a pipe. That's all for today. Thanks for watching.